at Pinton Hills. Let him call the sprint car racing for a knock on the suit and holding the gap in that fall time. You know, I knew starting in the bottom there was going to be heat. Uh, the top was kind of real dirty. It was hard to run up there. And I, yeah, I got a real good start. I think I got a third or there in the first half. So I thought we'd be in pretty good shape. But uh, I got up in the second there pretty quick. And then the 92 was going pretty good. And he just slipped off the floor one time, allowed me to sneak underneath him. And, uh, uh, I can't get in the lead that early, though. Because uh, you're running out there by yourself. And, you know, you're not sure where everybody else is running. So I came up on a couple lap cars. And I went to the top down here to get around him. I didn't feel too bad. And uh, when I saw the 21 was second, you know, it made me think, you know, is he getting around the top of the move? Because like I said, it didn't feel that bad at that point. And uh, I think I heard him down here a couple times. And, uh, then we come up on a lap car, he was kind of running the bottom. And uh, I kind of made him mind to try to go to the top down here, try to get around him. And at that time there, he entered the top. And I about spun out, and Ryan got back by me, and uh, I turned and got back underneath him. And got back by him going into one, and the yellow came back, and I was like, yes. I said he had me at the line, they're going to put him back in front of me. And I came around, it was him sitting there, so uh, we kind of lucked out there. Uh, you know, he would have been tough to get by, uh, you know, if he was staying at the bottom. I don't know if he was running the bottom or where he was running. You know, I didn't really see him until he passed me, but I heard him a couple times at the top. But, uh, you know, we'll take it. Uh, we were the worst car I ever had here, I think, last, last week. Uh, Pulled off, we were that bad, and uh, come out this week. And uh, we changed a lot of things around for the heat. We were real good heat there either, but I uh, uh, got to thank Dennis Kohler. Uh, you know, he changed everything with the driver. I think everything from the future and uh, must have so. Well, fortunately, you kept the driver. You are. Uh, you must like your dark spots. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think I won a few races of these guys are here, but, uh, you know, maybe they, maybe they can come every week. <laughs> well, we'll, we'll get Dave in here, but uh, I'll tell you what, what a difference one week makes and then uh, over what a difference two makes. Yeah, he's been with us. Uh, you know, a whole year last year, and uh, a little bit of the year before that, but uh, last year was the first full year with him, and uh, we just seemed like we kept getting stronger and stronger. I was really looking forward to this year. Uh, uh, we didn't start out the best. First, the first week we were pretty good, we ran second there, but the second week, uh, you know, me and another car got together and heat there, and, uh, you know, of course, deal there, and uh, had to start the back of Conti. We actually went out with Conti with a better race car, and so now I managed to get the feature, and we salvaged the 11th place spot there. But, uh, like I said, last week we were just terrible, we were way off. And, uh, uh, so it's good to come back next week and uh, we'll see if we're going to win. You mentioned Tyler, how well he was going to fuck, but uh, there are a ton of young drivers out here that are just amazing. Yeah, it's kind of it's kind of weird racing out here, and I'll tell you the truth, uh, uh, you know, there's no Fred Raymer, uh, you know, it's a different race around him. Uh, it's still taking me a little while to get used to seeing Luis in the 14, but uh, you know, I'm sure he'll get going here. You know, he hasn't ran race here that much over the last few years, but uh, uh, he'll get going there. He's still an excellent driver. But, uh, yeah, a lot of young guys here. Uh, Tyler's doing a real good job. You know, he ran some last year in the 410 there, and I thought he did a good job last year too. But uh, yeah, those guys are just going to keep getting better and better, and uh, you know, it's going to be harder and harder for us, uh, I guess, better guys to win now. So. Uh, but uh, yeah, you know, hopefully, uh, hopefully we have a good year here, and uh, hopefully it's a good race here this year, and uh, uh, fans will enjoy it. Why are you all going to race